Hello everyone, this video has been brought to you by Unacademy. My name is Mohit Gupta and in this video I will be talking about an algorithm named Digital Differential Analyzer also known as the DDA. So let us begin. A computer has to take care of two things while plotting any line on the computer screen that is which pixels to plot and what all computations are required to calculate the pixel positions. And DDA the Digital Differential Analyzer is an algorithm that helps computer find these things. Let us first see what a slope intercept line equation is. Any equation of line of the format y equals to mx plus b where m is the slope and b is the y intercept. is called as the slope intercept line equation. What is a slope? Slope is dy by dx. Let us see with the help of an Cartesian diagram. If this is the line from x1, y1 to x2 y2 then slope will be y2 minus y1 upon x2 minus x1 so this is the slope of this line having equation y equals to mx plus b also the y intercept will be y1 minus m times x1 So we have the slope and the y-intercept. So let us now begin with talking about how does the DDA work. We have to select pixels on a grid. Let us assume that this is the computer screen and we have to draw a line from this point to this point say. So at every position we have to select pixels from pixels on the y axis from this or this, this or this, this pixel or this pixel. So to find these correct pixels to light so as to make the original line be plotted similar to the line on the computer screen we have to do some calculations. So what does the DDA do? We first plot the initial points that, that is this point x0 comma y0 and this point is x1 comma y1. So we plot these this initial point and then we find out x comma round of y. What is the round function? It rounds off the floating point value to the nearest integer value and what is y? y is nothing but y naught plus m times x. because we are incrementing x one unit at a time so x will be one similarly when we have got the next point we get next x by incrementing x by one and next y by incrementing y by y naught plus m this is when slope of line is less than one that is x is increasing more than y. Or the dy by dx is less than 1. So we follow this procedure when the slope is less than 1. 
and how many numbers number of times do we have to repeat this that is determined by x1 minus x plus 1 times in simple words we have to repeat it till x0 equals to x1 the initial x coordinate becomes equals to the final x coordinate that is the number of times we have to repeat this procedure we always will calculate x is equals to x plus 1 and y is equals to y y plus m and keep on plotting x comma round of y so that is the case for m less than 1 now let us see what will be the case for m greater than 1 when m is greater than 1 this implies y is increasing more than x or dy by dx is greater than 1 so in that case x of k plus 1 will be equals to previous x plus 1 upon the slope of line and y will be y of k plus 1 will be yk plus 1 simply so for the initial points we have x is equals to x naught y is equals to y naught simply we will now plot round of x comma y you can see that we have reversed the rules of x and y when the slope is greater than 1 so we keep on repeating this process and we will get x is equals to x plus 1 by m y is equals to y plus 1 remember that this is the previous y y from the previous iteration and this x is also from the previous iteration we repeat this process until y equals to y1 as we did in the case of when the slope was less than 1 so that is how the DDA works let us take a quick recap here if the slope is less than 1 we plot points round of y and x if the slope is greater than 1 we plot points round of x and y so that is how the DDA works in the next video I will be explaining the DDA with an example a very detailed solved example so that you can learn how to apply this in practice so you should subscribe to the channel youtube.com slash an academy to support us and more videos in this series are the DDA algorithm solved example if you have any doubts or queries you can ask me on Twitter my Twitter handle is at hi underscore Mohit Gupta or you can directly tweet to the an academy also or you can leave a comment in the comment section of this video also thank you for watching